Welcome back. Today we are going to learn how to classify triangles and quadrilaterals. Triangles can be classified by their angle measurement into right triangles, acute triangles, and obtuse triangles. Let's first look at a right triangle. This type of triangle has two perpendicular lines that meet together to form a right angle. A right angle is exactly 90 degrees and is the key characteristic for a right triangle. Sometimes a 90 degree angle is indicated by a little square where the perpendicular lines meet. Next, let's talk about acute triangles. These triangles are characterized by having three angles that are less than 90 degrees. Angles less than 90 degrees are called acute angles. All three angles in the triangle must be less than 90 degrees to be classified as an acute triangle. Finally, we have obtuse triangles. These triangles have one angle measurement that is greater than 90 degrees. To recap, right triangles have one 90 degree angle. Acute triangles have three angles less than 90 degrees and obtuse triangles have one angle greater than 90 degrees. Next up we need to look at quadrilaterals. A quadrilateral is just a shape with four sides, like a square, rhombus, rectangle, or trapezoid. A square has four equal sides and four right angles. A rhombus has four equal sides, but does not have right angles, it looks like a slanted square. Rectangles have four right angles, but different side lengths. Trapezoids are funky looking shapes that have two acute angles and two obtuse angles. They do not have to have equal side lengths. Have fun practicing. We think you are ready to classify triangles and quadrilaterals on your own.